So I'm very pleased to be able to announce that the winners of the inaugural Health Volunteer of the Year Award for New Zealand are the Cancer Society Canterbury West Coast Division Rural Groups. Paul. <laughs> got the award for all the rural volunteers. I believe it's about 360 and for the work that they do for the rural community. It jo if you knew what the team said when we were chosen, and I know that Diana said her team was the same, they were just all blown away. We couldn't believe it. Because we don't believe we do anything more special than any of the other groups. It's the Wellington Free Ambulance Street Hospital team. We've been long hours at night on the streets of Wellington. And after Rugby World Cup is over, we can see the benefit uh, both to us as a service but also to the community of Wellington by doing the street hospital uh, process. Joan McCardle of St John's North Taranaki has made a huge difference to the experience of patients in emergency departments. With a good team and reliability, it just has really been appreciated and the patients think it's just great. The organization to empower young people with disabilities through performance. So we do um, music, dance and drumming workshops. I do the Jazzy Jammers workshop, even though I'm a terrible dancer. It's immensely rewarding um, for, honestly, a, a pretty limited time commitment. I, I like the, um, the workshops are an hour and a half a week and you just you emerge feeling like your, your karmic checkbook is completely balanced. It's, it's amazing. I think it's important because um, there are a lot of people in New Zealand yeah. that you know give their time they don't expect this mind you it's, it's something that sort of comes to well for me totally out of the blue for me personally I think it means far more for, for the organisation for the other volunteers I mean I would see myself as a representative of, of all the volunteers in Wellington Free Ambulance I mean I happen to be I guess the lucky one that was singled out well, as a school we all fundraise um, for Relay for Life um, to fundraise to the research um, of cancer and stuff like that. A lot of the school um, shaved their hair. I think it was 10% of the school did that. We raised seven to nine thousand dollars in the end. Yeah, because it doesn't take much to get a bucket, go down to the supermarket and yeah, stand outside for a moment. Yeah. So on a final note, thank you all very much. Uh, our health service in New Zealand is all the much better because of the contribution of so many volunteers in our community and uh, it's just been wonderful to be able to acknowledge some of you here today.